Hey, family, friends, fellow gamers, educators, and students. Welcome to Grumpy Gnome Gaming. I am Grumpy Gnome. Let's get some grump on. Baldur's Gate, baby. Here we go. Um, first of all, I'm going to lower this down. 25. Good enough for the government. Okay, and um, if you remember last time we... Um, we finished the archaeology site, and now we went back to Nashkel, and we got ourselves a room, and um, we're all fresh and crispy right now, so I think what we're going to do is hit the road, Jack. Um, don't, don't you come back no more. And what we're going to do is... Yes, yours. it will be done. We're going to go ahead and... Um, Go back to Old Caster. It will be done. Because now that we've got the ancient armor and the idol, we can go ahead and uh, trade in. There's Old Caster. Please be dark. Doggone it. Doggone it. Well, let's see if there's enough to keep us occupied over here. I think, you know what, that hobgoblin that we were looking for might be somewhere around here and the reason i need to find done. that hobgoblin is because i don't know if we pulled the boots off of him or not and the reason those boots are so important is because they um they're boots of stealth And um, I'm not going to waste too much time looking for this guy because he might not even be on this map. No. Okay. Well, let's look at our map here and see what we need to do still. Okay. It looks like we need to go into this area up here. I don't know if we're going to be able to talk to the ghost or not. Um, I don't know. So let's go ahead and um, go to this ramp that's going to take us up. That bothers me that we that I don't know if we got those boots or not off of that halfling. Not the halfling. Oh, oh, look what we got here. Did we never encounter what this person? Hey, that's missile weapon. Ooh, I don't want fire arrows. No, we want regular arrows. As a matter of fact, I'm going to pull those down right now. Idle can go up here to you. And, um, wow, we got 77 arrows. We should have bought some while we were in Nash scale. What you got? You can drop that into there. You got that magic two-handed sword. We need to identify that. And make sure that you're just using regular bullets. You are going to use regular bullets. Yeah, like that. <laughs> like that. Okay, and... Um, what you got? I wonder, you know what? Let's pull those down. And, you know what? Let's do this. Boom. Those can go over here. Those can top you off. Like that. That's good. That's good, 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 good. Okay, and did we pull your magic ones? Yes, we did. Here, I think I'm going to split these. Uh, so, 10. Done. And I'm going to give 10 to you. Now, the question is, are these the same? They are, but I don't want them shooting those. And... Top you off a little bit more, but I don't want you shooting those. 
All right, man, we are ready to go. Let's bring it on. Uh-oh, where are my peeps? There they are. Once. Boom. And here we go. Cha-ching. One stand against me. Bloom, bloom, bloom. And, well, there's no boots. <laughs> but we will collect. Actually, you are going to take arrows. You're going to take sword and gold. And Jerry is going to grab that. Now, are there more hobgoblins? Fine. Yes, there are. Here we go. It's on again. You're already dead. Awesome. This time, Jared is going to take some arrows. He'll get the gold. And you are still collecting swords. I don't think I'm going to take the bows Speak anymore. You insist. Yes, there are. Here we go. Resist and die. Resist and die. Okay, uh, Jared. Your command. Whoops, you're too far away. Give me a task. Okay. Very well. And an, oh, two more. Right on. Let's bring it on. Split fire. These three on this one. These two. Yes. On this one. Here we go. Feel my power. Whoa, we got more coming in. Okay, so now these two. What is your will? On that one. Oh my God! How perfect was that? Let, <laughs> what? Let's go do our corpse dance on top of them. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Now, let's. I know they all got swords. So let's get gold bag in there. Boom. More swords. Boom. We can get gold swords. There. Jared. Speak. You're gonna take jewelry. Jewelry. Man, there's still no um, no boots here. Not cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, are there any more? It does not appear to be. Okay. We'll be content with what we got. Let's go up here. Do, 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 do. We'll slowly clear this area out over here. Um, well, maybe go this way. <laughs> we'll go this way. Are you just a skeleton? Yep. Okay. Well, you know what that means. Yes. That means we're going to our... Yes. Mundane weapon, not Speak. mundane. Whoops, that thing. We're going to we're our um, blunt weapons. Go on, man. Oh man, I had an old man moment there for a. And you know what? It really sucks with the thief. I'm almost wondering if we should just make the thief uh, with a staff. It's not really a a thief weapon but it sure is practical because that way we don't have to go into the inventory every time and um, pull the staff out like like that I'm wondering something also If um, if I got that two-handed, not the two-handed, the short sword of backstabbing, I think that was the one that was the whisperer. Because now that I'm starting to think about it, I probably should have given that long sword specialty to um, Grecius and given him the plus two short sword and the dagger. It is what it is. Give me a task. Okay, go, go break some bones. Fall. Oh my Fall. God, there's a lot of them. Whoa, what are you doing back here, Grab dude? My attention. There we go, and get up there. You're 
already dead. Into the fray! Awesome. Ooh, and those are composite bows. Those we will pick up. Because Again. those are coin. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. And let's go ahead and stock up on some more arrows. So you're going to take one, two. And then Jared. Yes. You're going to take one, two. And that's it, man. Yes. We're done with that. Let's keep moving. If you insist. Keep on chuglin, 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 chuglin. John Fogarty, give me a call. There's our ghost right there. The ghost of old caster. Let's go strike a deal with him. We're going to give him the um, ancient armor, and we're going to give him the idol from the archaeology site. And he is going to give us a sword. Here we go. Cha-ching. And the best of schools. And we just got to keep talking to him. A storehouse of overkeen knowledge. Lost. All lost. A common dungeon now. Whoa, don't go away, buddy. All for knowledge did we strive. Nothing left. Hope would return with the retrieval of the simplest of tomes. Beneath the rubble on the lowest floors. Return hope. History is so important. And, um... We all shall live again someday. Okay, we're still talking to him. We're still talking to him because I am convinced. Man, I sure. Well, maybe we need to come here at night and talk to him. Okay, I'm almost starting to think that maybe this is a nighttime adventure. I'm going to try to do a quick save here because I really don't want to blow this. Kind of like we did with Commander Brage or Captain Bragg or whatever his name is. And another thing I want to see. Okay, end it. Quick save. Cannot. Oh my god, we can't save it right now. Are you absolutely kidding me? We need to speed this thing up a little bit. Oh, there he goes. I, mean, I guess it's not going to speed up for us, is it? What I want to see is if, um, do I still even have those two items? No. Are you absolutely kidding me? Okay. Okay, where where did the items go? Oh, wow, he gave us the sword already. No, he didn't. Oh, there it is. The vampiric sword. Okay. Good, good. I was waiting for some kind of dialogue to come in saying that that we made that trade, but um, there is the vampiric sword right there. Uh, this thing is cursed. Um, 1d6, long sword. Oh, I guess it's uh, not going to tell us 
what it is. Yeah, it's got the blue hue around it. But we'll identify it, and then we'll take a look at it. In the meantime, yeah, thanks, old caster. We appreciate you, man. Let's um, let's clear the rest of this out. I am not going to go back to my missile weapons, just because there's probably more skeletons in this area. You know what? I think we've already done this, but we'll do it again. Um, gully kin. And we thought that might be Durlag's tower right there. For some reason, I thought Durlag's was a little bit lower, but that might be it right there. Very well. Very well. Well, that was a, a waste of a little bit of time. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this is another one of those little labyrinths right here, but it's an easy one to go through because you can kind of see what, what where everything is. Gullykin. We'll do Gullykin also. Indeed. Really, the um, not much to do in Gullykin. Uh, it's an access point to get to the Firewine Ruins. What are you? Oh, you're a stinking kobold. Yeah, now we're going back to missile weapons. Go figure. You'd go to missile weapons too. What is the plan? If it happened Again? to you. Here we go. And cha ching. What? Get him. Get over here. Okay, we'll take that. And you know what? Go on, then. Just because we want to mm -hmm. top you off. How many more are there? Indeed. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Gosh darn it. Stupid game. Speak. It's like, yeah, we're going to switch weapons Your around guide. on you. Your command? Speak. Is that everybody? You rang. Give me a task. I guess so. All right. Yes. Go break some bones. Oh my gosh! And there's more kobolds. Nuts on a biscuit. Well, let's get rid of this guy first. Now let's get in there and smash some kobolds. We're not even gonna bother changing Seek weapons that. on them. Get over here. Okay, now, now that we're still in corpse dance mode over here, what do we got? We got some gold. Gold is always good. We got a necklace. Jared is going to get that. You were like a needy child. You're like a needy child. <laughs> um, Jared's going to pick up some arrows while he's here. And you know what? You know what? Let him just pick those up. I think that's it. That's it. Okay, man. Let's move on. What is your will? My will is to move on. Can we start I going? In to work in the dark. <laughs> mm. Okay. Start going into this labyrinth here. This little maze of things. And like I said, there's there's not much in here. You might find a a cobalt or something that wants to jump on you. But for the most part, we're just kind of clearing it out to clear it out. And there is a... Um, yeah, we should, let's go this way and come around here. Somewhere in this mess here is an entrance to the... Um, I don't know if, it, if the tab will show us where it is. No. Uh, let's come over here. No, it's not over that far. I think it's down here somewhere. Let's come over here. And let's go ahead and bang some more heads.
Come on, guys, you're late for the parties. Get over here! Fall. Get over here! Feel my power! Awesome. Well, there's some jewelry, so Jared. They'll find your body in the river. Way to go, what? man. There's our um, entrance to the um, to the ruins that we came out of. So once again, there are three Get over here. three entry points. Well, entry exit points, and um, it all depends which route you're gonna take. And basically, we got what we what we wanted, what we came for. We can go ahead and clear this little bit over here. I'm trying to think where we want to go next. As much as I want to finish the Firewine Ruins, we're, we're not ready for that yet. I think we did everything on this map. Yeah, that looks pretty clean. Um, back to Baragost? Yeah, maybe we'll go back to Baragost. We'll regroup, figure out what we're going to do next. Uh, I think we, um, you know, let's go to High Hedge. We got a little bit of, yeah, we got about a half hour. So let's go to High Hedge. And uh, just like we did with Temple, let's go ahead and clear some of the region over there. And there should be another seashore area. I think it's called the Shipwreck. And Shipwreck should be right over here somewhere. Okay, where were we going to go? We were going to go to High Hedge. Yeah, if that's Durlags, we're not going anywhere close to there. Um, Gully Kin. Let's see. Eight hours. Is it going to be dark when we get there? You have been waylaid by enemies and must defend yourself. God got it. Okay. Um, I think we still have our. What is the plan? Our magic, um, our blunt mm -hmm. weapons, in our hands. Mm -hmm. Go on, then. Epic, epic, epic. Let's see what happens. Two arms. Wow, Jared. Dorn, the blackguard. One shot at him. Strangely familiar. Okay, whatever that thing is, it did a whole person on me up here. <laughs> You get up here and help out with that thing. Okay, why are you guys just standing there? Okay, you guys get on him. Jared, what? what Speak. Just hit the thing. Just hit the thing. <laughs> there we go. Yes. Oh, what are you doing? Just standing around up there. Oh, you're held. <laughs> okay, that'll work. What is your will? Let's go ahead and pick up uh, some stuff over here. Are you losing? Why does it keep doing that? Now that wasn't cool. We might be going to heal first before we go anywhere else. Um, you? Yes. 
uh, start picking up some of these composite bows. And um, come over here. Agreed. You agree to that? I like the, I like it when you agree with me. Uh, come on down here. And there's another composite. We have a composite over here. Nope. Do we have one up here? Nope. Okay. What's fine? Here we go. Now you Rang. get some more arrows. That's it. Okay. And mm. come over Very here. Well. Nothing. Come on up here. Got some more arrows, Jared. Quickly now. Arrows. That's it. Come over here. Agreed. Any more arrows? Nope. That's it. Speak. Indeed. Let's get out of here. Where were we going? I think we were going to Gullykin. And it is dark. Mmm, that's on a biscuit. Okay. Let's, um... Let's change yes. the plans. What is your will? Fine. Will is... Let's go to High Hedge. You have been by really? And must defend yourself. Oh, man. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Okay. I'm looking to see if I want to go south or if I want to go north. I think we're going to go this way. Yes. You're going to take him out. You're yes. going to take him out. You're going to take him out. And you too are going to take him out. Make it happen. Okay, you three on this one. Get you too on this one. You're already dead. And you didn't see that. Wow, I like the way they just kind of went over there and it's like, hey man, you guys need some help? Again? So one, two, three, four, five, six. Jared. Prefer yes. to work in the dark. There we go. Speak. Uh, anything Indeed. over here? Nope. All right, man. We got everything. Let's uh, let's clear out of here. My head. Here we come. Do, do, do. Oh my god, and it's dark. Nuts on a biscuit. Okay. Oh, change of plans. Where do we go next? Maybe Baragos. And, um... Why don't we go to the... The temple... And identify those few magic items that we have. Yes. What is your will? Oh, oh, that this is not where I wanted to go. Did we just lose? Um, oh man, we just lost those those two encounters that we did by doing this. I wonder if we can go back. Uh, back. Um, oops. Nope. Oh man, I think um, I think we did hit that continuation button. Yes. Uh, nuts on a biscuit. Okay. Indeed. Well, we know Gullykin is dark. We know that High Hedge is dark. Let's go to Temple. You have been way late Are you absolutely serious? Yes, as needed. 
What's spit it out? Let's do this again. We had so much word. Yes. Why aren't you moving, dude? You know, I'm just going to let them go in auto mode and see if they figure out what needs to get done. Like, I can already see this guy here is standing around eating grass. Mm -hmm. So, we'll do that. Don't have any idea what these guys are doing. Damn it. Damn. Ah. Uh, okay. That worked. Yes. Jared, he's he's a little bit beat up right now. Speak. Anything over Simple here? Enough. Nope. Okay. Out of here. Temple. That's where we're heading. Oh my god, it's dark. But you know what? We can do this. Kind of find our way around here. If you insist. There we go. Seriously? All right, what is it? What is it? Okay, I'm just going to... We're just going to go in there with... Um, with our hand weapons. Try this again. Oh no. Where are we at? 1030? Oh man, we're paused. Yeah, we'll go ahead. We'll identify. You know what? And if it's light in Baragost, maybe we'll... Um, Maybe we'll rob a few houses while we're there. And I think the only magic items that we have are these two down here. Ooh, it's almost time to recharge. We're going to have to plan that one out. Mm, we're not going to identify errors. We already know what they do. Um, okay, you got some bows to sell. But you don't have any magic. You've got nothing. Actually, you do have something. You've got these two that need to get identified. Yep. So let's give those up here. What you got? I don't think you've got anything. We got some jewelry here, but we'll go ahead and throw that into the bag. <laughs> the gem bag of holding. All right, we were able to restock some arrows. So let's go ahead and top off, top off, top off, and top off. Now, now he's looking good. You are golden. You are golden. You're okay. You know what? Top off. And... Identify those four. Here we go. Let's do this. Do, 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 Give me do, a do, task. Do. It will be done. Don't touch me. I'm super important. Okay. What do you got? Identify. Uno, do, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, cinco, seis. All the girls say I'm pretty fly for a white guy. Dexter, give me a call, dude. Um, identify. Boom. We just did that. 
Cursed Scroll of Weakness. Cursed Scroll of Petrification. Cursed Berserking plus three. And the Vampiric Vampire's Revenge. Notice it doesn't say cursed. Interesting. But what is this thing? Oh my god, it's having a whole freaking novel to it to identify okay it would seem that this uh, very speculation of this weapon existence has conspired to pull it from the realm of fantasy into every day although as with all things that come from dreams it is not as it truly seems the blade is indeed vampiric the name would suggest though not in the manner the finder might have hoped it is rumored that the blade, instead of performing as one might think a vampiric blade would, uh, was actually constructed by vampires as a trap for those that could eventually oppose them. These incredible clever fiends have apparently fashioned numerous versions of these unfortunate blades over time, and they are the bane of all right-thinking adventurers. Okay, so if you are a right-thinking adventurer, you might be wrong. So become a left-thinking adventurer. Each swing actually inflicts damage upon the wielder as his life energies are drained in order to heal his intended victim. Uh, were this not enough, the weapon is cursed so as to prevent its removal, and the user is smitten with a wasting of the mind. Ooh, so it also messes with your mind? That he or she may not even think of trying to rid himself of it. Wow, so I wonder if maybe a removed curse will not even work on this. Uh, okay, it may be among a few things. Simple worth trouble. Anyway, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Have a lovely beverage. Affects intelligence in a negative manner. I think the may only be removed with a removed curse. And it inflicts damage against holy nuts, man. Yeah, so this is this thing is bad news. We will sell it. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Okay, what are we doing? We're done here. We're done here at the temple. Thank you very much. Yes, very well. Betagust. Let's go to Betagust. If you insist. 39. Got 20 minutes. Well, 20 minutes if we see this thing all the way out. Betagust. I do want to finish this area here before we start venturing this way. Just so that we don't have to come back down here anymore. It is dark. Nobody likes it when it's dark. So you know what? I think we are going to head over to Feldepost. We'll just get us a room. And... Um, Just get us a room and we'll call that we'll call it the game there. Be on guard. Cities are full of people, and people cannot be trusted. Wiser words have never been said. Here we go. Over here. And where's my entrance? There it is. Ching. So we'll get in here, we'll go ahead and we'll do some healing for our party. I think we are, if we haven't already cleared High Hedge, maybe we'll start with clearing it. And then I think I need to charge my Necklace of Fireballs, or the one gift lost is the more appropriate name for that. 
Okay, so first thing we're going to do, who's hurt? You're hurt. What is your will? Well, you can use that on him. You can use that on him. And actually, that's going to heal him all the way up. Perfect. I wonder how many more experience points do we need? Okay, you... You've got quite a way to go. you got 23,000 to get to the next level. How about you? Oh my gosh, he only needs 612. Man, check this out. 21 Charisma. 21 Constitution. And if I armed him with the buckler no that it no I think he is armed with the buckler thing okay how you so you need six oh, 621 okay that's cool 23,000 23,000 8,000 okay so two people are might be leveling up in the next episode. Other than that, that's it, man. Everybody's healed. Let's go ahead and get our rooms. The reason I do that check is because if we only need a couple experience points to make it to the next level, I'll go out and I'll find those experience points before resting because we may just gain another spell. And if we rest first, we're losing that opportunity to fill that spell slot. Let's talk to him. Indeed, you want some whiskey? Yep, what do you got? I want a peasant room. I'm gonna rent it. Do, 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 do. We can also do Kagan's um, quest. Even though it's not a quest in Enhanced Edition, you actually need to have the, uh, what is it, the SCR or SCS um, mod installed in order to actually get the full benefit of his quest. Anyway, we're done. Okay, guys, aim for the door. And we'll call this the episode. So, guys, if you liked it, please give me a, um, a like. If you didn't like it, give me a sympathy like. Uh, if you're watching me on Twitch, please hit the follow button. If you're watching me on YouTube, please hit the subscribe button. I am on Facebook and Discord at Grumpy Gnome Gaming. So if you get a chance, go ahead and hit me up on both of those. If you do any of those things, tell 10 of your family, friends, and pets about my channels. If you don't know 10 family, friends, and pets, tell five of them twice. If you don't know five family, friends, and pets, go out and buy yourself a hamster. Name the hamster Boo. And if you get that reference, leave a comment below. I am Grumpy Gnome. I'm out of here. In 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.